The great American food writer James Beard once said, there's no greater treat than a, a piece of bread straight out of the oven or even a muffin. And if you slather it up with fresh butter, it becomes a feast. And there's no butter better than butter that comes straight from the farm, from a place like this. We have a mixed bag of color breeds, because when you're, when you're making cheese and butter, you need to have some color breeds that have a higher butter fat so that it makes a better product for you. The Vaughn family strives for the best, the best milk, butter, and cheese, which means raising a healthy herd of cows on their 250-acre dairy farm in Harford County. But the Vaughns were quick to learn that things don't always go as planned. Everything seems to be a crisis some days. Regardless of how many years you've been practicing your craft. Daily Crisis Farm started 40 years ago when we first started and it seemed like, you know, everything that you read about in a storybook for, for farming, it doesn't always happen. Things are always breaking, tractors, equipment, animals, you know, get sick and stuff. So we decided that it was, it was Daily Crisis. For Karen and her husband, Dan, the seemingly constant chaos of dairy farming has become a way of life that brings the family together every day. It is a good lifestyle when you're raising kids. You know, you're here, it, it's family oriented, you're with them all the time. You know, we raised three girls here, now we have the grandkids. Third generation farmers, Ruth and Leela Rowland, are following in their grandmother's footsteps. They're eager to help around the farm, especially with the livestock. They help with some feeding, they help scraping the barn, they help me with the chickens, gathering eggs and feeding the chickens. And no matter how busy things get, there's always time for play. They're good little helpers. They're just getting to the age now where they can, you can kind of send them on a mission, which is kind of fun to watch them growing up the way that we grew up. Kim has worked on the farm full time for 15 years, taking in all that it offers, even the aroma. I enjoy the outdoors. It's weird, but I enjoy the smell of fresh dirt. I enjoy watching crops grow and cattle grow. Plus, I get to hang out with my nieces and family time and that sort of thing. Right now, family time means coming together for the evening milking. But first, Kim needs to put the feed out for the cattle. It takes around two and a half, three hours of milking in the morning and at night. They come in on their own accord. I mean, you do sometimes have to go out and get them. And usually when one gets up and starts to move in, the rest of them will follow, but there's always some that just don't want to cooperate. Although most cows know when to come home, some need a reminder from Farmer Dan. They provide a life for us. They provide a product. If they are not healthy and they are not well taken care of, they are not going to produce something that is a healthy product. This herd of 50 will produce about 2,500 pounds of milk today, which will be hauled out for processing and eventually make its way back to the farm in the form of butter and specialty cheeses. Right now we offer cheddar, Colby, Italian herb, horseradish, a smoked, a garlic and chive, and a hot. One of the really cool things they're doing here at Daily Crisis Farm is working with local wineries to produce wine-flavored cheese. Here's how it works. They start with their basic cheddar cheese, and then they'll add some Chardonnay or some Merlot, and they come up with a really tasty morsel like this, which is awfully, awfully good. Now, we're going to put information about the cheese and the butter from Daily Crisis Farm, along with the recipe for their pumpkin chocolate chip muffin, right on our website. Go to mpt.org slash farm, look it up, and you can try it at home. For the local buy, I'm Al Spoiler. Joanne? Thanks, Al. Be sure to check out mpt.org slash farm for all our local buy recipes. And you can watch full episodes there as well. Also, don't forget to follow us on social media for show updates and a look behind the scenes.